Hi, D. Hi, Joe. <laughs> oh, sorry, I was over on Jamie's channel, and we were. <laughs> I don't know why they. Uh, we, we started talking about. They started talking about the. God damn! Would you stop it with the ads? And he, these aren't web ads. These the web ads. These are coming through. And annoying me excessively so. They're coming through Windows 10, and Windows 10 is just not behaving today. So, yeah, Mr. Boomer here. Uh, karate! Oh. Uh, speaking of which, I did watch The Crow again last night for the umpteenth million time. Hi, Jamie. I was just, just talking about the live stream. We were having a little conversation about which, which stream and which channel. Unfortunately, hi Lauren, thanks for joining. I appreciate it. Uh, the, the issue is I can't stream on my main channel, Michael Weiner channel. That's why we are graciously using the uh, Team Tiny Psycho channel. Um, until April, I think it's April 11th, I can actually go back on my channel. Because I made the mistake. I made... Hi, Sharonda. Nice, for, nice of you to stop by. I appreciate it. Uh, I made the mistake of doing a stream about a month and a half ago for on Jackie Gleason and showing, you know, all the honeymooners and all that old stuff. I love those shows. And these were supposedly in the public domain, according to what I had learned. And apparently, uh, Jackie Gleason Corporation, the family, just decided, nah, sorry. You, nobody can play. There's none of it in the public domain. So... I got a copyright strike. I'm not allowed to stream for 90 days on my main channel. So we created this one. Um, this will become something else maybe once we're done, but who knows. The Coloring Diva. Look at all those, these nice happy faces. Hi, everybody. See, I told you, definitely not a, definitely not a sexy 62. So. <laughs> but that's okay. Thank you. I do appreciate you stopping. This was a lot better than sending you all nudes because nobody wants to see that. Trust me. Um, what we're going to do today, this, this, this channel is kind of wild. We do some Chantal uh, mukbang reviews. We do some ALR mukbangs. We do some what I call FIDs or Feathered Kids, where we look at funny bird videos. On Fridays, our moderator gets to work her magic and do it, you know, and, and show us whatever she finds is hilarious or, or something that's not funny, but whatever the moderator decides, that's tomorrow's stream. Uh, we're definitely keeping that around. That seems to be fairly popular. The weekends are kind of up, uh, up a little bit. Sundays we do. We've been focusing on the Westminster Dog Show. There are a couple other dog shows that we're going to take a look at, but those seem to be fun. A really nice way to chill out on the weekend on Sunday and just hang around with some friends and chit chat and have a few laughs. So that's pretty much what this channel is. Um, I know most of you have never been here before, so thank you again. I appreciate you stopping by. Thank you, Jamie. I do not like advertising in other people's chats. That's why I asked, because it just, it's just being polite. Anyway, um, I'm sure I've seen this one, but uh, hey, look at the title. You know, fart warning, messy eating. What could be better? So let's get into our grill, shall we? Okay. Oh, you're a little loud with your music. There we go. Happy holidays, everybody. Now, if we start talking about breast size again in this channel, I'm gonna have to leave. Okay, just warning you right now. You talk about whatever you want. I'm just kidding. Oh, that conversation went sideways quickly, guys. Sorry, Hi. girls. Hello, guys. Hey, Not right now, Phoenix. All right, so apparently it looks like she, no offense, but it looks like she almost sort of kind of just rolled out of bed and not trying to be mean. All right, Jamie, thank you. All right. <laughs> it's your so, fault. Today I have for you? Yeah, the nails. The nails I can handle. I have a bag so, of groceries. I said, shh. Because no, so buddy, not right now. I'll, I'll you can come up and do it. All right, fine. So just a few things. Hurry up. Um, come on. 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 Don't, don't put, thank you. Like Tail down. Nine hours. We don't do we cat button this channel. Sorry. Wow. So, wow. I'm wearing the beanie. It kind of 
fit. <laughs> so this is an 18 inch. That should work. I've been picking up fur balls all day today. Get paid to eat. Okay, let me set this up. And kill yourself okay. on stream. Yeah, baby, yeah. I so what do we got? Chicken and chicken and french fries and lots and lots of ranch. All right. Let me get All right. Oh, you want to say hi to Joe? Let me say hi to Joe. So I have a macaroni salad. He just, he wants to be on camera, but he doesn't like to look at the camera. Oh, because of the ring light, probably. This is Huh, huh buddy. All right, you can sit for a minute, but I need my keyboard close by, okay? I don't know about you, but I love drumsticks. Out of, out of all the kids in a family, I would eat the drumsticks and leave all the rest of the meat for everybody else. I just, I don't know why. I just love drumsticks. They would get the breasts and the thighs, and I'd be left with the drumsticks and the wings. Best part. So good. I thought I said hi to you, Dee. I hope so. Wasn't ignoring it. Oh my goodness, look at the so- Holy shit. Alright, yeah. Way, way, way to drum up that thumbnail. Stupid. Uh. It's got like cheese. Oh. Are those jalapenos? Oh, those are pickles. I, I would prefer jalapenos than the pickles, but... Okay, let's try this. Oh, is that the one you posted the other day with the anchor on it? Well, personally, personally, I, th I think, yeah, we'll get to the sandwich in a minute. Let's answer your question first. Personally, for me, I wouldn't put company logos on myself. Twitter, Facebook, YouTube. You know, I, I just That's just me. I know some people like to do that. Eh. Uh, now, true, I do wear a, 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 a shit ton of corporate logos. You know, come on, folks. Let's get real. I advertise for channels, people, restaurants, breweries that I enjoy all the time. So, I, I you know, I'm not going to be a, a little hypocrite and say I've never worn a corporate logo. That's a bunch of shit. But... Uh, oh, that's another one. Oh, okay. I like the compass. The compass and the peace sign, I think. I, other than, I just, I'm not big on the logos. But it's, it's you're wearing it, so it's what you like. That's what's important. Mm -hmm. So let's take a look at the sandwich, shall we? She gave, she gave us a really nice, really nice view. So let's get back into it. It's got like cheese. All right. So what I look, what it looks like to me is two chicken patties with probably Swiss melted in between it, lettuce. I can't tell if that's cheese or obviously some white shit on the bottom, which I can't tolerate. You know, ranch, mayo, whatever. Pickles, which I sort of understand that. There's a Tennessee chicken recipe that uh, that, that has the you know Tennessee hot with the the pickles, which ugh, sorry, not for me. Uh, I like the hot stuff, just keep the pickles. But, uh, yeah, that's it. What do you think, D? Want to have one? <laughs> oh. I mean, the sandwich doesn't bother me. I could probably do the sandwich, maybe with some fries. But there's no way in hell I'm going to be able to do the sandwich with all that chicken and the fries and her buckets of ranch or buckets of sauce. Okay, let's try this. Okay. Please, please, please don't do that. Please, please don't do that. We're gonna have to start pulling with Shane. <laughs> it doesn't trigger me as much as Shane, but it, it, it does trigger me when she does that. And I absolutely love the giraffe in the background. I want that giraffe. My daughter would kill for that giraffe. Yeah, my baby girl has this thing for giraffes. Ever since she was a tot. I, I don't know why, but she's always loved giraffes. Mm -hmm. And that in the background. Guarantee a BB got that. <laughs> Grinding gluten guts. <laughs> Uh, 
Uh, and, and I'm sorry, this is definitely not as chill a, 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 as the last stream I watched where it's somebody was just coloring in these beautiful colors. Oh, it's so relaxing. I love it. I love putting that on when I'm working. It's like barbecue stacker or something. Those nails are going to give me a little problem. Oh, here we go. Oh, okay. It's act it's an actual side. Holy shit. Wow, it's an actual side of mac and cheese. Go figure. Oh, wow. Four foot and bra Oh, that must be that must be really neat, Sharonda. Yeah, absolutely right to comment. Go ahead. For real. Uh, my parents have a wooden one. Uh, my mother, when she was alive, God rest her soul, she was into carousel horses. And when I say carousel horses, I mean really carousel horses. She would go to, my, they both would go to parks and, and, and things like that that were closing down. And they were, you know, getting rid of stuff. And they would buy and then renovate the, uh, <laughs> their idea was to buy one for each of the grandkids. So right now there are four sitting in my dad's basement and there are four grandchildren at the moment and each one has a targeted recipient. And my youngest, the baby of my family, gets the giraffe because she loves giraffes and I kind of, you know, I played favorites. Two minutes, no eating food. Whoa. But you, you should see these things. Oh my God. I mean, they are, they are act what you would actually remember walking into a fair and getting on a carousel. This is exactly what's in her basement. Uh, impulsive, blah, blah, blah. I, I am. Yeah. Kind of cool. I mean, they're, they're gorgeous. I just can't. Right I don't know if I have any pictures. Why? Honestly? Well, the, the thing is, Diva, the fact that she has a diet soda makes all of this okay to eat. It, 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 it kind of it's the antithesis of all these calories and, and fat and salt that she's eating. It makes it all go away. I'm just happier when I'm eating crap. Yes, you're, you're, it, Lauren said it right. You're, you're absolutely right, Lauren. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I can't, I can't do soda or pop. I, I really can't. It depends on what part of the country you're in. I say it both ways. I've lived in Wisconsin for three years. I lived in Vermont for three years. I lived in Pennsylvania most of my life and Ohio. Those four main states, and trust me, we all say it differently, and it drives me crazy. <laughs> That's why if I don't... Exactly. Exactly, Lauren. You hit, it, hit the nail on the head. Honestly? That's why, I, like that you said, I don't say pop or soda. I say give me a Coke or give me a Pepsi, which I haven't had any of that shit in well over 14, 15 years. I do love my malt flavored water. Yes, yes. You say Coke? I do too. And when I was growing up, it was always pop. Well, I know, Jamie. I know it's Fago for you. I and mean, I understand why. And you can... <laughs> so I thought I would continue with the story of my life. Now, I'm You're a Packers fan? Well, good for you. Yeah, I lived in I lived in Milwaukee for three years. Uh, just outside a little town called Cedars, Cedarsburg. Or Cedarburg. Cedarsburg. It's plural. Cedarsburg. Uh, ten minutes outside of town. I miss Milwaukee like crazy. I love Milwaukee. I knew you were going to say that, Jamie. <laughs> Wah, wah, wah. Man, that's good. No, it, no, 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 no. What are you doing? Reggie? No. Um. Where did I leave off? Oh, you're from Massachusetts? One of my favorite states in the, in the continental United States. One of my favorite all-time places in this country is Cape Cod. I, I've gone there almost every single year. I haven't gone in the last two years. I really need to get back. I miss it so much. Mm. Very special place for Maggie and I. 
And even before we got married, actually. I was going up there when I was single. This is my mom alone. Oh, place. don't get me started on Louisiana. Uh-uh. Where did my dad split up? Uh-uh. We need to make a road trip to New Orleans. Oh, absolutely. I have a, I have a friend in England. I would love to, to take her down to New Orleans. She would love the French Quarter. Oh, sorry. It's just been a bad day for sciatica. Eventually she's going to want a boyfriend, right? Oh. You're making me jealous, guys. Come on. I look... I live in west side of Cleveland. <laughs> okay. Not a... Yeah, I mean, it's a, it's a nice city. It really is. It's got a lot to learn about living living right next to a great lake. Kind of like what Toledo has done. We could learn a lot from Toledo. Uh, the city could be a lot more livable, if you know what I mean. But it's okay. We've come... The city's come a long way since the Cuyahoga River caught on fire years and years ago. It really has. I'm naturally... I love the cable. We would stay in Falmouth because it was fairly inexpensive, and we would stay at the Tides Motel because it was it was expensive as shit, but it was cheap, relatively speaking, and it was right on the beach. We everybody had their own private little beach. They would do uh, 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 clam bakes and oh my god, I just miss it so bad. I spent some time in, 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 in Michigan, Toronto. I used to geocache up there quite a bit, in Detroit. So eventually my mom got a boyfriend. And in fact, we would we would uh, spend quite a bit of time up in, uh, oh, what the hell's the name of the island? Shit. Oh, it'll, it'll come to me when, I, when I'm not thinking about it. We do not like each other. Her stories are always pointless. Six. That's what everyone called him. I don't know. I thought he was cool. I pretty much drive through there, that area, when I'm heading to the Cape from where I'm at now. No, not Mackinac. It's, um... No, no, no. I, I, I know Mackinac very well. Um, <laughs> there's a special hotel that my mother absolutely adored. Um... No, it wasn't Mackinac. Um, shit. Bell Island. Bell Island. So we would go up at, at, at twice a year. I have a couple friends that are geocaching friends that live in, in Michigan. And he would hold an event on Bell Isle. And we would put out 50, 60 caches. And people would bang the hell out of that place for a couple months. And then we'd go back out. We'd rotate them and replace them. But we, we'd spend a lot of time there. And then we'd get up to uh, go uh, gambling and get up to the casino and that kind of stuff. Always had fun. He was like... She doesn't know what vegetables are. She really doesn't, Sharonda. But I agree. Mm -hmm. That's that's the one I'm thinking of. Yeah, that's that's her favorite. Doesn't it have a grand... Uh, what is it? It's not a balcony. What does it call it? When it's the porch that kind of wraps all the way around. I can't think of the name of it. But I... He wanted to be a rock. I've never been there. My mother had, had been pressuring me to get up there when she was alive. With the band six. So the band six you have to, you have to time band it right. Six. You have to time it right. Or you could get stuck on that island for a while. Here I am. Rocked you like a hurricane. Here I am. Rocked you like a hurricane. Yes. Yes. You're right, Jamie. I think they also sing Mr. Roboto. And the beauty is, I can I can be in Detroit in probably under three hours. And yeah, two, I think I got it down to about two and a half hours. Um, and, and yeah, we have a lot of fun there. Oh yes, we do. But we have stirred up a lot of trouble. We've been chased by police. Uh, we have been watched by security. You know, all kinds of weird stuff because there's a, a, a. We tend to use like abandoned shopping malls and plazas and things like that to put the caches in to kind of keep people out of the public eye. The police and security all know this shit. Hey! Hey! <laughs> Don't ruin that song, bitch! I think. I could be wrong. <laughs> See, I'm sorry for me, that drumstick would have been gone ten minutes ago. <laughs> 
and that's one of the reasons why we're not watching her newer stuff, Jamie. Uh, we're, we're trying to keep it old, right? Uh, you're right. I, 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 I've seen that video, her last few videos, so many times. I, she's never going to... What? You already left hair all over me, dude. I can see it all out of my eye. But she's never, ever going to change. Get down. Get down. And the only way I think she's going to change, and I'm serious about this, is YouTube really needs to put a stop to this content. Now, that hurts people, you know, that like to react and commentate on it. But this is for her own well-being. And I think YouTube's the only one that's going to be able to stop it. Because if she can't stream and she can't monetize this behavior, I think then... Maybe only then will she consider making some lifestyle changes. I don't know. I doubt it. But if there's no coin at the end of it, then why would she do it? Why would she continue to hurt herself? <laughs> Jamie says hi, you little nudge nick. And again, that's why we don't, we're not we're not we're not trying to we're not focusing on you know what she's doing now, because far too many people are doing that, and I don't want to. This is already repetitive, if you know what I mean. But I just I, I don't care. She's never going to change. She's not. None of them are. And there's only one way to stop it, and it, it's going to hurt others in the community. But yeah. maybe it'll save her life. Maybe it'll save her life. Who the hell knows? She, like, yeah, I, 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 sadly, you're right, Dean. I want to know what's in that, in that cup she's dipping in. It's not her typical ranch. I don't even listen to her stories anymore because 99 times out of 100, she can't repeat the same story with the same detail. <laughs> even back to back in the same damn stream. <clears throat> Hair metal bands in the 80s have like beautiful luscious hair, like Mr. Lagoon's hair. Well, he was missing a lot of hair like I am now. So it's like just like crazy and like balding. <laughs> now, does she suffer from alopecia? Is, is that her problem? Does she suffer from alopecia? Is it gravy? Thank you, Jamie. See, you're actually paying attention. Which I'm kind of surprised because I know you stepped away from the girls and I do not blame you at all. That's why we don't get involved in that new shit. Just no. no too much. There's too much crap in that. Don't want it. <laughs> no, seriously. But do, does anybody know? Does she suffer from alopecia? Is that why she's extremely thinning up top? Oh, well, isn't that isn't that alopecia? Isn't alopecia hormonally based? I, I could be wrong. I, I have a friend that lost her entire head of hair. A poor girl. She had a beautiful head of hair, too. Yeah, she was so sweet. She even came with me to my daughter's wedding. <laughs> even though she's not married, but she has a boyfriend. She, they live together. And he's like, yeah, take her. Go. <laughs> so we had a lot of fun, actually. But yeah, she lost it all. I mean, she had such a beautiful head of hair. When I can remember, maybe. I was like young. I was like six. <laughs> okay, so, so, it, so it, it's probably more... Okay, it's probably more cancer. Okay, I got you. Thank you, Dee. Yeah, and I think you were smart, Jamie. And we're going to speed her up because if I keep talking, we're never going to get through even this video. And I have a couple that I want to get to. So let's, let's bolt her up just a little bit. Because honestly, the best Chantal is high as shit and fast as hell Chantal. Sped up Chantal. Now, you with he didn't live with us or anything, but he would stay over a lot. I'm like, she broke up with him and this is why. But anyway, he called me a closer. I don't like the progress we're making on our, on our chicken sandwich. I, you really need to focus on that chicken sandwich. It's going to be cold as hell, and it's going to be disgusting, and you can't reheat that. It will never be as good as when you first bought it. That's the worst thing about fast food. If you don't eat it right away, reheating it. Ew. Can you imagine reheating McDonald's french fries? 
They are my favorite, but I insist they are fresh out of the fryer as hot as possible. I can't reheat them. They're, they're disgusting. I've never found a good method, other than maybe a, a dry, uh, a, uh, an air fryer, maybe. I haven't tried that. But that's a lot of work to reheat a bunch of french fries. Seriously. I'm thinking about so She is. She's hilarious when she's stoned. That's what we should do. We should do it. We should do a, a, a high Chantal collab or a, a collection of videos. Who does that? No. No. I really would. At some point, we probably all wanted to call a bride's home too, which I was. Didn't. A cockpit. We don't hear it. We don't hear it. We shake it like a little cockpit. We don't sing it. This is the first. Even on the weekends. Pretty sure. I would. I said shh. Her stories drive me absolutely up a wall. <laughs> no, sir. You have to get down, sir. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> well, even 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 her eating basically you know, what was she doing? She called them what did she call them? Uh, her dress ups. Her mock-up, uh, where, you know, she tried to do, uh, uh, oh, what the hell did she call them? She had a name for them. Where she would pick a movie and then pick a dish from the movie that kind of iconified it. Which she always fucked up one way or another. Excuse my English. But, uh, those were at least semi-entertaining. Even the, even the Peeps movies that they did, it, at least it was something. It was an effort. Unlike this channel, which puts absolutely no effort into anything we do here. We are the lazy streamers. <laughs> it is what it is. Time more. Ah, Jamie, you're on it today. And I love six. They also sing a. No, sir. Oh, please don't ruin that stick song for me, you bitch. God, that sandwich is huge. Oh my god, that thing is huge. This should be the symbol for gluttony. <laughs> it is. It really, really is. This picture right here, symbol of gluttony. You said it. I would have grabbed a screenshot, but. Oh, well. I'm going to take a little break. Inter intermission. So, he's saying he. I would actually like a little bit higher so tilt on her tray because i she's got it stacked up i can't really see what she has totally left but she's barely touched that bur that chicken sandwich don't be chewing on my keyboard you ding dong what is wrong with you plastic's not gonna taste very good you idiot he's like oh i think i'll gnaw on your keyboard you're not playing it you're not paying attention to me stupid human Uh, all right, Jamie, thank you. Keep licking those fingers, man, I tell you. So if it's like a poutine sauce, a gravy, I, c I could be up for that because it's not different than eating poutine. The only thing missing is cheese curds. So it depends on the kind of gravy it is. It's got to be, you know, fairly peppered gravy to be really good. Then? And I do like chicken in that type of gravy. It is delicious. My mom met. The man she's married to to this day. Is how, like my sister's father. Uh, my stepdad. He always liked the dad. How to open my mouth. We had a rough time when I was growing up as a teenager. But now we're really close. And I appreciate everything he's done for me and my family. And, um, oh, shit. Uh... That's gonna have to wait. I can't deal with that right now. So, she met him around that time. And I remember for the longest time, on the first date, he bought her this balloon with flowers, and the balloon was like a foil balloon, it was like Garfield. And she kept it, it was deflated, but she still kept the deflated balloon with flowers.
<laughs> oh, you asked for it. Uh, no, we don't care about you. I can't, I can't even read. I can't even type what the hell I'm reading. I can't even read, I'm typing, dumbass. <laughs> oh, we have all kinds of videos in store for you. <laughs> oh. Okay, let's get back to it. If I can find it. Where the hell did I go? I lost myself. How did I do that? Oh, go away, Discord. Get out of my hair. Yeah, we're not watching that. Sorry, we're not. Now, Michael just lost his damn mind. No, we're not doing that either. Ah. Uh. Screwed me up here. Screwed me up. I'm sorry. But yeah, don't don't ever tempt me. Don't ever tempt me. I have a weapon. <laughs> I won't. I promise. <laughs> but that's that's evidence that uh, you know there's a there's actually a good bit of footage that you do not want to watch. And I'm I'm staring at this I'm staring at this chicken part that she started to gnaw on and she left all this meat on this bone. This would drive my father absolutely crazy and he would yell at you. And he would demand that you hand that chicken bone down to him so he could clean it off properly. Look at the food you're wasting. So she met him. You know, he did a lot for us. And we did a bit of work for my mom. And she's being a single mom around you, so shout out to all you single mothers out there. Honestly. Ugh. We're all holding it down. Huh. Huh. <laughs> I'd be full. Yeah, I mean, I could do the chicken sandwich. I could do the chicken. And I could probably do some fries with each one of those, but not all that together. I just couldn't. Especially with the sides. Because the sides are good. And, 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 and I think Lauren said it. She's got absolutely no vegetables either. None. Other than maybe the lettuce that's on the chicken sandwich, which doesn't count. Oh my god, I can't believe I just saw her do that. I cannot believe we just saw her do that. Oh my god. There, there, there is no hope for this individual. There really isn't. There really, really isn't. It's sad. It's really sad. She, she, she... she she eats herself. She brings herself, her body to the point of almost complete breakdown. She rolls right back around and does the same damn shit within a couple days. She's never going to learn. Ever. Ever. Ever going to learn. The only thing I remember about this school, I think I was for grade one right there, was chocolate milk. Just having a chocolate milk every day. Yeah. And the classmate Carlos, every class has a good milk cake. And this time it was Carlos. He was just like, he was always so naughty, you know, always in trouble. Um, they made you stand and sit in the corner, like no dunce hat or anything, but um, it was really weird. Like, I don't think they do that nowadays. I think that would be like a good No, thing, sir. Probably. But people were not strict back then. No, so, sir. Not so, right now. No, yeah. sir. I said not right now, sir. <laughs> Thank just, you. I'm Thanks for sure playing. To the at some point. <laughs> Go sit down. I'll feed you when we're done. Yeah, we're so we're so not going to be going that long today. Good for you, man. Good for you. But he would like throw up all the time just randomly. I don't know if he did it like revenge for you or what, but 
you hear kids like, Are you trying to make me puke on stream? I mean, seriously, are you trying to make me gag and get sick on stream? No, I've never done that before, but that could be arranged. Oh, Joe, that's disgusting. Oh, God. Now, now I have these mental images in my head. I thank you, Joe. Oh, on that note, I need. I, I would like another beer if that's okay with everybody. <laughs> Hi, Maya. I didn't see you. How are you? Hope you're doing okay. Thanks for stopping. I'm gonna grab another beer because I just got grossed out to shit. Oh God. I can't watch you do that. I, I really can't. Because <laughs> it makes me gag. Sorry, Diva. I, I I apologize. I, I'm not trying to drink. If I could share, I would. Trust me, I really would. It's currently you know going on 20 to 4. I've been working yeah, way too long today, so this is my break, and uh, I'll probably get back to work here in another hour or two, maybe three. <laughs> you know, we deserve some really sweet people. <laughs> but cheers, folks. This is not a lightweight. This is you don't want to drink this. If you're on a, if you're watching your carbs, you do not want to drink this beer. It is not a lightweight beer by any stretch of the imagination. Love you, Maya. I'm pretty sure it's just like tomato rice, but it's like really savory, sucked to the ribs and comforting. Mmm. Oh, that's good. Yeah, it's really 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 good. Yeah, it's I remember drinking Heineken. It's been a long time since I've had a Heine. In more ways than one, but no offense. That was a little TMI, I'm sorry, but you deserved it. <laughs> you guys were dumping TMI on me during the last stream, so uh, it's payback. I'm so hungry. Oh, I don't know. <sighs> Miller, I, 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 I don't know what to tell you, Jamie. Um, it's it's an okay beer, it, it, especially in the winter, in the summertime when it's really really hot and you're you know, it's nice, light and refreshing. It's low carb, low uh, ABV. So yeah, yeah, I get it. Not my kind of beer, but I get it. I get it. This is an IPA by my friends from Fatheads called Headhunter. It's an amazing beer. It's their flagship IPA. It's a West Coast IPA, very hoppy. In fact, every beer that Matt of uh, uh, Fatheads makes, Matt Cole is the uh, Ed Brewer, every beer that Matt makes is overly hot. Don't kill me, Matt, but it is. <laughs> and I love it. Oh, here she comes. Watch out, boy, shoot you up. Oh, here she comes. Sam Adams, Sam, I can, I, I like Sam. They, he, Sam Adams makes a really good Oktoberfest. Um, and if you haven't tried it, oh, it is really good. Just, you, you don't, just buy one. You know what I mean? Nice and copper t color, and it's delicious. So. It's called a split for a reason. Yeah, we know you don't. We, you, well, I have I have uh, mojitos set aside for you, Joe. Just for you. But it's called a split for a reason, right? You split the... Oh, this stupid idiot. She's going to leave that meat between the two bones because she, she can't suck it out. No, you're going to have to get down. Sorry. <laughs> Thought it was playing. Oh. 
also attached to the tool. But this one, I think the priest there was like discovered. I think it was trying to be purged. Yeah, that's the one with the curly priest. No. Oh. You haven't seen her wielding a scabber lately, have you? Yeah. Oh man, that's cool. I told you guys some story times. No, we don't really want cool your story cool. times. Like, We're kind of tired of your story times. And my teacher was named Sarah Louise. My sister Louise, she was nice. She was nice. <sighs> catechism. I can't even remember. Maybe they studied catechism. As it is. I think they're so different back then. We're so different back then. Balmy weather I won't like, last long. Well, no shit, Sherlock. <laughs> it's almost like making fun of Sherlock. He does one video. He makes me laugh. So More like, cold and snow. Oh, joy. <laughs> Yay. Thank you. Like, Just what we sure wanted. Yeah. More cold and snow. Joy. I wish I could show you. There's like no snow out there anymore. And we had we had piles of snow everywhere. Must have been a two and a half foot pile in my neighbor's yard next to a sidewalk. Oh, happy Thanksgiving, by the I'm not sure. She showed it earlier in the stream. And without my glasses, I, I have a hard time even seeing that clearly. I'm like so done. Let's see. Excuse me. Here's a look you're not gonna see again. Okay. It doesn't really look like anything specific. It just looks like it's got a maybe a quasi gemstone in it. I don't know, D. That's a good question. Looks almost like it has you know an arrow going this way and going this way and holding a stone. I don't know. <laughs> so you made me put my goddamn glasses on and why do I do this? Why why did I bother? <laughs> God damn it. Since I've been working remotely, yeah, I, I don't. I don't. I, I really don't. Yeah, we're not gonna watch that. Uh, okay, here we go. Let's get into her. Well, you're always a wise ass, Dee. That's why I like you. <laughs> oh, no. Get the goddamn cat off the counter. Get the 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 cat off the counter. Please get the goddamn cat off the counter. Please remove the cat from the goddamn counter. Say hi. Oh, yeah, hi. He's busy you want to hear me rant? That is one thing I will rant about. There is a... I used to watch videos with somebody a long time ago. And they made me watch this one video. I don't remember who this person was. Some celebrity that, that they were enamored with. And I didn't know who it was. I didn't care who it was. It's like, you want to watch it? Sure. You know, I'll watch it. And the dogs were on the counter. Her dogs were on a goddamn counter in the kitchen. And I, I just I was like, no, I can't watch this. I said, those dogs get to get off the counter. And she freaked the fuck out. Because the dogs on a counter, I said, the dogs on a counter were triggering me. She goes, well, you said you wanted to watch it. I said, well, I didn't know what the content of the video was. Getting the food out. So we have some oh, fruit today. Drives me today. crazy. Um, he knows better. We have. He goes on a counter. He gets a flying lesson instantly. New York fries, yum. Um, so I have a hot dog. And so do I. And butter chicken. Hey, in. since we're all doing TMI today, what the fuck? And he has fries. Fries. With fries. Soup, and that's it. Boring. My Little Pony fries. Yes, I'm boring. Yes, you are. So let me show You're you also rather creepy chicken. and disgusting. Yum. And we oh are God, going to. So I don't know if you guys Speed like her up a little bit. Oh, yeah. oh, you're a fucking retard. I'm sorry. Excuse my English people. Oh. You know there is a there is a there is a way to get. Th Never mind. <laughs> we did a thumbnail. I don't know. Leave that in. Doing the thumbnail? Yeah. You think it's funny? 
Yeah. Especially me asking how long do we have to look like this? <laughs> oh, I see. You want to be clever, don't you? <laughs> so. But wait a minute. Wait a minute, though. Chantal Amberlyn Reed tells us that YouTube picks the thumbnails. So I'm really confused. What is it? What's the truth? As if I don't know the answer to the question. Pete has a, something he wants to tell you guys. Oh, no, no, no. Of I'm just kidding. We don't need to hear any more of her pornographic it. fan on fiction. It's animated on, on Netflix. It's uh, really good. Um, it's got two musicians living on Mars. Named Carol and Tuesday? <laughs> yep. Carol with an E on the end. Uh, and, uh, <laughs> yeah, it's a really fun show, and it gets uh, really emotional at times, and it's just, uh, yeah, it's really good. The sad thing is, it still stinks even after she cleans it. Mm. It definitely doesn't have that new car smell. Really? Yeah, I should have sold a whole bunch of packs. I'm just joking. So this is their big wiener. Oh, oh, whoa, 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 whoa! All you put on it was mustard? Oh! I'm sorry, you're gross. Chantal. <sighs> Right. Oh, okay. I see some onions, but that's all I see. I'm just doing... And I don't care what anybody's gonna say. I like ketchup on mine, and I love, love chili on mine. No, he doesn't. You're right, Jamie. He doesn't. He's he doesn't know how to drive. And he, why should he bother? He's got her to tote him around. Never. Like I'm Becky does with I'm... Amber. <laughs> I don't have my tray out. You don't need a tray for wieners. Mm -mm. Mm. Really red. There we go. Is that helping? No? <laughs> a little bit? Like you guys can answer. I'll explain it to you, Jamie. Much like you have the vault for this information, Joe has that kind of vault for ALR shit. I don't know how she does what she does, but she does. It's funny as hell. Sorry, we were like so hungry, eh? Yeah. Yeah, but you gotta put ketchup on there. Fuck you. <laughs> Pretty hungry. I prefer chili, mm. uh, chili ketchup onion. Oh God, no mustard. Oh, also the and if you don't have jalapenos, I'm probably not gonna eat it? at your store. Uh, variety. The, uh, the main duo is uh, just keyboard and acoustic guitar. Um, yes. So, pretty most, so those two are mostly fairly simple, but uh, really nice songs. But there's other musicians featured as well, and they all do. Uh, the whole point, D, is he's a lazy piece of shit. He has no reason, no incentive to learn. He works at home. She drives him everywhere he needs to go. So why should he learn? Why should he learn? Uh, and they all get really cool and sing songs. <laughs> the mermaid sisters. Oh, I thought you were like thinking about Xanadu or something. <laughs> particular have the anthem of 2018. Xanadu. Yeah. Shut up! This relish is so good. Now they're bothering me. Cool. If nothing else, look for the song by the Mermaid Sisters. You won't regret it. This guy... Is this the kind of material you would have if you had your own channel? No, we don't want him on the road. Even in the Ottawa's, we don't want him on the road. We want people to be safe. We really do. She's bad enough. That because is... when she drives, she's distracted. She has a camera in front of her, and she's distracted. So I do have a problem with that, but that's a different story. Uh... So much talking about X-Men. <laughs> speaking of which... Some people might like that, though. Speaking of which, maybe it's just me, but... House of X and Powers of X, the Hickman... Hickman Silva mini right now. I'm just not feeling it. The what? The current main X-Men title. Movie? Oh. Oh. I don't know if anyone, uh, any of you are reading it. Uh, yeah, I'm just not feeling it. I like soap opera, and he's giving me a textbook. You know what we had to do for... Yeah, we did that for my sister, and we also had to put a block of wood on the clutch pedal when she was learning how to drive because she couldn't reach the clutch. 
She couldn't depress it all the way. It was hilarious. I was loving it. So fucking funny. But... So much explaining things. Mm. This is making me want hot dogs for dinner. Is that last night I thought, oh, we watched. Who did we watch last night? Oh, we watched Sam, the food guy. And he made that onion burger. O-M-G, was it amazing. So I was like, okay, I gotta have me five guys for dinner. <laughs> the snow's melted, there's a path to the house. I need me some five guys. I ordered two burgers and their uh, Cajun fries. I figured I'd have one last night, I'd have one today, I'd cut the fries in half, I'd be happy. Nope, I was so hungry yesterday, I ate both those damn burgers and almost all the damn fries. I'm such a pig. So now, now I don't have a burger for dinner. So I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to think of something for dinner. Well, uh, what time should I be there, D? I don't know how much of my audience. <laughs> and I like my uh, Thousand Island on the side. Please, just just a heads up. I had an itch down there. I bet you did. I don't know how much of your audience had Mitch down there. <laughs> Tell us in the comments if you have an itch down there. Shut up, peeps, you dumbass. He is so not funny. Never. <laughs> you know your audience watches you because you're... Yes. Exactly. You know what? That hot dog never had a chance. There's not been a food item ever created on God's earth that has a chance standing next to you. You will devour anything and everything. Thank you, garbage. Oh, marble right. Mm, D. Is there any more relish? Oh. Oh. Damn. If you weren't married. I'm gonna go back in the mall and get these. <laughs> okay, so I have, I wanna try. I got some garlic aioli. Oh, actually, may, actually, maybe I should order uh, from. Uh, what used to work here? Gold bellies. I can get some Ew. New York deli, truly New York deli delivered in a couple when of days. I used to work at New York Fries. Fresh, we made the garlic strami, like corned beef, it with something. rye bread, she out, deli I pickles, she deli out mustard. A, oh, um, oh, oh. Container of pines, garlic so aioli. Good. I'm like, and it tastes nasty. Okay, let's try this poutine. I got some. Well, poutine. Just lost your chance at a sponsorship. At a high sponsorship. I don't care. Every time I open my mouth, I lose a chance. Those sound really good, Jamie. Those really sound good. A sponsorship. <laughs> yeah. Let's try it. I do like poutine. I'm getting on my shirt, so I'm wiping this side. I think you should wear a bib. You should always wear a bib. I agree with him 100%. And she doesn't. She never has. Doesn't matter, doesn't even matter, what, matter what you're eating, you should be wearing a bib. It's beauty bite. What, what a dumbass. Where if I'm eating a bib. <laughs> Wear a bib to eat the bib. Mm. She would, too. She'd suck that bib dry. Okay, this is really Edible good. Edible bibs. Good idea. Somebody get on that. Let's go on Shark Tank. This is, um... California seasoning. Make everything more salty. You guys like New York fries? California seasoning. What the F is that? I've been to California many times. I've eaten in California many times. I've never heard anything called California seasoning. Give me a break. I always get the put in. I want to try something Canadians. different, you know? Ugh. Good. Mm -hmm. Oh. Want a bite? Oh, sorry. I'm trying to get comfortable. So good. And for the record, it is poutine. Not poutine. It is poutine, you fat dumbass. And you know what? Canadians don't give a shit how you pronounce it. We're not French. We don't care. It's poutine. Get a grip. Mm -hmm. And you know what? You're not French either. <laughs> Oh, we come from the Ottawa. Doesn't make you fucking French. Fucking asshole. I get people correcting me. It's poutine. It's like, yo. 
It's poutine, you dumbass. Wait, I'm French, okay? No, you're not French. You are not French. I guarantee you. We look up your background, and your history. Oh, I was. I, I live in. Fuck. Well, her blood is eighty percent green. Well, Joe, that's not a fair comparison. I think what you should probably say is she probably eats more in one day than you do in a month. No offense, sweetie, but I think it's probably a little bit more accurate. She knows <laughs> what food is called. And trust me, I have to work on portions, too. That's my point. Oh, man. This is really good, but I hope it doesn't give me heartburn. The fries are fresh. Oh, yeah, and it's called Notre Dame, too, right? <laughs> oh, good one, D. Yikes. <laughs> or like, for white. Look, I don't care if they're French. I don't really give a shit. You know, it's poutine. It's poutine. Is calling them Yanks racist because... Go anywhere in this story? country. They're not going to call it Putin. Is it derogatory? A little. <laughs> and she, <laughs> she sprinkles Yanks. far like more of that California seasoning on there. Which is probably... Honestly, it's probably nothing more than um, Lowry salt or all-season salt. Like they would use it like Red... Uh, Red Robins on the French fries. You know what I mean? I think that's what she's actually referring to. I've never heard it called California seasoning before in my lifetime. And I try to I try to attribute as very little to California as I can, because I'm not a California guy. Can't really stand the state myself. Americans are called Yankees. Yeah. Oh. And uh, yeah, us non-Americans call them Yanks for short. And you know what, Pete's? We call you a fucktard for short. How's that, you goddamn wackadoodle? Oh no! Okay. <laughs> My first this wife one. was like that. Anytime she wore a white shirt, anytime she wore a white shirt, it was bound to get disgustingly dirty. Whether we were eating or whatever, it's such a shame. Well, this is really good. I'm sorry, guys, about the quality of this video. <laughs> no, you're not. No, you're not. You don't care. All you cared about was eating yeah, on camera. Just everything about this video is kind of half ass <laughs> Honestly. But that's okay, right? Yep. Oh, no, D, it's not going to be hot sauce. It's ranch. That's her, that's her sauce of choice. She is a ranch girl through and through. Oh my God, she has eaten more ranch than I have seen anybody ranch in my lifetime. You got major surgery. You got major surgery. Okay. In fact, if you've ever seen, what's that stupid pizza commercial, where where the girl comes over, you know, and the guy never ordered a pizza, but the girl comes over to give him a thank you gift from the pizza shop, and it's this big gallon of, of ranch. <laughs> I want to find that and I want to send it to Chantal. Any time it's upon half as is now. Well, we all know. We all know. Pete's wants it. Oh, we're gonna do this weekend. Oh no! Sunday. What time? Not sure. We have an appointment on Sunday. Riveting. I can't tell you on camera. I'll tell you off of camera. <laughs> then you don't bring that stuff up on camera, or you edit it out. Um. Probably afternoon sometime. Hmm. Ariadne is another Ghibli movie, and it's a really good one. It's based on the book uh, Borrowers. I forget who wrote that book. Um, yeah, it's just about the... His taste and shit is wacky. Uh, this is a guy that has a My Little Pony collection at home, and I'm not kidding. Tiny little people who live in um, who live in houses and take uh, little things from people. Can you me all the fries? Yeah. Oh wow. So. Hmm. I'm only saying oh wow because he usually doesn't even finish a medium. We were hungry. Hmm. Okay. Jesus Christ. Apparently so. And yeah, Area is just a really cute movie. Nobody's really listening to you, peeps. So why don't you shut up? Well, well, I'm excited for it. And her delivery system is amazing. She pushes so much shit onto that fork. Here? And shoves it into that little pie hole of hers. I mean, she's not happy with two or three fries. Oh, no, 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 no. There's got to be at least a dozen. 
Watch this. Look at that. Look at that. I want to see Spirited Away. Yeah. Yeah, that was going to be uh, in October. Jesus Christ. So. Let's see how you're feeling. You know, and that could be a choking hazard. Has she ever thought about that? At that point. She needs a lot of neurological help. She really does. You'd be able to sit in a movie theater for two hours. Well, it's that, but it's the driving. Yeah. What? Excuse me a minute. <laughs> you know. In November is Princess Mononoke. And in December is the Princess Kaguya. Never saw that one. It's really pretty. Based on a, uh, I think Japanese legend. Um, yes. Legend of something like the Excuse Bambi or right something you. like that. The story that uh, they have a bummer who probably would say, uh, Baby in a bamboo tree. Mm -hmm. And uh, takes her home. And the and goes from there. She grows up quickly and gets noticed for her beauty and blah blah blah. There are some people I cannot ignore, unfortunately. It's a nice legend and uh, really good. Thank you. Yeah, Appreciate it. The download token. So wow, pretty. thank you. <laughs> yeah. Even my Jeep. So I can continue to do my work. Go oh, joy. <laughs> I'm listening. I'm just super fixated on my food. I'm used to that. <laughs> I'm sorry, folks. I, I don't have much of a choice here. <laughs> Alright. Should be good for a little while. <laughs> you know, when you're super tired of me. Oh, no! You don't be careful. You're going to be wearing that gravy that's left in that box. I broke her. Sorry, guys. <laughs> that one's on me. What did you say? I, I do tend to agree with you on that one. <laughs> <laughs> the, the, the thing is, I don't think there's any trigger for satiation in her brain. I really don't think there is. I think that's probably the problem. She doesn't know. Her body, her brain isn't sending that signal of when she's full. Thus, she, her body doesn't think she's ever satiated, so she's going to continue to eat. Right? So. I'm glad you could laugh a little bit, Jamie. <laughs> Espe think? Especially on this subject, because I know, I know you walked away, and I think that was a good idea. I think it's best for your mental well-being, and you're much happier. You really are, I guarantee it. Well, we were... <laughs> <laughs> Just talk. I hope you leave this in. <laughs> it's hilarious. What did you say when you were going to the ball? That you're slow. No, I said. Oh, no, you said you're slow, and I said, <laughs> and I said, yeah, and you move, uh, and you don't move fast either. She <laughs> is slow. <laughs> oh, I can't breathe. <gasps> imagine it. She laughed to death. I I can't imagine. I mean, okay, I am not a doctor. I'm not a nutritionist. I'm not a psychologist. Psych. I'm none of those things. Okay, I'm an IT guy. I do have some educational things that, that help me in certain circumstances, but as far as this goes, I don't think there's anybody that's gonna be able to help her. She needs some very serious therapy. There are things going on in her brain that need fixed, that are definitely sending wrong signals to her, and this is why she looks the way she does. My sister wasn't much different. My sister, was huge before she passed away. She just couldn't stop herself from eating. She's always eating. She didn't know why. Nobody could help her. Nobody could help her. Woo! I can't eat anymore. I almost ate the whole thing. <laughs> you only have one bite left. <laughs> See what I mean? See what I mean? You were right about It'll be gone. It will be gone. You know it's going to be gone. Before I killed you. <laughs> You were right about to finish it before the involuntary manslaughter there. Okay. Okay. And she would have to get rid of all of these bad influences. Not not that Peeps is necessarily a bad influence, but he 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 doesn't help. He enables her behavior. Excuse me. 
This is a mess of a video. Should we even publish it? Yes. I'm editing. <laughs> okay. Okay, guys, I'm gonna go now. <laughs> I would be I would be out of that car in a heartbeat. Ooh. Okay. Okay. I got something sad. <laughs> yeah, unfortunately I don't think Dr. Phil's gonna be seeing anybody anytime soon. <laughs> but you're right. I agree with it. Bless you. Anyways. Say bye bye in the video. Bye. <laughs> Those guys make me laugh. They really do. All right. Oh, boy. A big, huge six cheese pizza mukbang. All right. Makes me hungry for a pizza. Hello. <laughs> Until I watch her eat it. <laughs> Brat camp. <laughs> Good one, Joe. Couldn't possibly look any more forced to look at me. Okay. Hello, it's me. Okay, I, I like the wig. It's obviously a wig. I'm not that stupid. Uh, it looks pretty. I like the color on her, actually. But uh, the makeup, eh, kind of lackluster. It's not really all that, you know, she really didn't look like she spent a lot of time on it. I'm about to do... Oh, please don't sing. The one thing I, one of the things I cannot stand about Chantal, she really thinks she can sing well. And she really can't. Thing in the cheek. I do too. I, I, uh, yeah, that's that eight bit little gaming little. Yeah, I can't stand it. Hi, guys. Hi. Welcome back. And of course, YouTube video. doesn't keep the setting from right. previously, well, so it's going to make me change the speed so yet again. Up. Well, we'll give her a little bit of oomph. Okay. 22. We, we may need to bump her up a little bit more. <laughs> I never understood why people pour their pop so fast into their glass. It's 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 cola. It's Coke. <laughs> what do you want? Look, he's looking at me over. Did you say Pete? Mm -hmm. All right. Ranch. Steven Sushi Ranch. Of, of course. course. And Oh, well, well, I'm sorry. This is a fairly recent one. This Six is uh, about a year ago. Pizza. It does look good. It Six really does look good, four. folks. Ow! Five. Like, damn it. Not five and a half. Sorry about that. Six. <laughs> There's a reason that six sounds like sex. Okay. No. Let's, six uh, sounds like six. Sex sounds like sex. Don't be an idiot. Um, give thanks for this beautiful food. And let's get to, let's get to, I have some embarrassing, I'm going to embarrass myself. Um, no, 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 no. <laughs> okay, we're definitely going to bump her up to my one grandpa. and a half. I talked to my grandpa recently, and, you know, oh, it's really hot. I don't really talk about Oh, BB? Okay. Um, with him because he's a very old-fashioned, traditional kind of guy. Well, I was looking at the room, so is this her bedroom? This isn't the living room. Unless she changed where she was shooting. And, um... Inquiring minds want to know. He looked up my video. What? I was like, oh, okay. Yeah, he's trying to be, you know, um, I guess nice. But he's like, oh, I like barbecue chicken. I like green beans. There might be some background noise as usual. Anime from this house, you know. Um, so, uh, yeah. yeah. I mean, he, I'm sure he thinks it's kind of weird what I do. But, um, you know, he was, like, born in, like, the 40s, early 40s. What, what, what don't people understand? I require a support request in order to be engaged <clears throat> in any sort of activities on my servers, on my storage platform, on my high performance platform. I can't just take an email and say, oh yeah, sure, I'll go ahead and do that for you. Why don't people understand this? I, I, it drives me crazy. I can't wait to retire. Then I don't have anybody telling me what the 
f to do when they're not supposed to. And it's 2020, so people don't go to war with briefcases as often as you think anymore. And there's no milkman, and people fur on the internet for money. So. Well, that's true. I, I do remember no. the milkman. Where am I going to fit this ranch? Okay. Move. Thank you. All right, guys. I have a coal chute on the back of the house that was converted into a, a milk dispenser. Not on the back of the house, on the side of the house. Uh, where they used to actually dump. This house is 102 years old, I think. Maybe a little bit older. And there's an original coal chute where they would come by and dump some coal down for you. Um, that got converted into like a milk dispensary so that when the milkman came by, he could leave it in there and nobody would... It wouldn't be exposed outside to the sun and all that kind of stuff. No, I'm not going through a midlife crisis. Come back in five years. Okay. Anyway, let's get to this pizza, baby. <laughs> Because I won't remember, you know. Daddy's hungry. Order what I want to talk about. Okay, so the first embarrassing story. Let's let's have a piece of pizza first. This is. If you dip it in that white shit, I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna scream really really loud off camera. Steaming hot, super cheesy. Oh my god. <laughs> it doesn't look hot to me. I see no steam coming off the cheese. The cheese didn't pull like it was really melty. Oh, Beauty bites. Fuck's sake. Well, they're, they're, that's why there's a lot of boomers running around because of the milkman. You do know that, right, D? <laughs> the milkman paying a special visit. I don't even know what kind of cheese. There's like six cheeses. I don't even know what kind of cheese. It's just six cheeses. Um, Parmesan. Probably. Romano. Probably cheddar. Probably a white cheddar. God, she's such a, she's an eating fucking machine. <laughs> she doesn't just take one bite. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, no, no, no. One bite is not enough. No, that's not satisfactory. I got to take two or three, maybe four, if I can fit it into my hole. Okay. All right. The, the eyeshadow's okay. I think she could have put a little bit more effort into it. I mean, her, her you know, her lids look nice, but there's nothing up here. You know what I mean? Underneath her brow. So I think she could have spent a little bit more time on that. Her brows look okay. Her lipstick, the, the color's cute. Uh, it it kind of, you know, goes with the red on her shirt and stuff like that. So, uh, yeah. So the first one. And this is, you know, um, I love Cheetos. It would be, D. It really would. I, I am really looking forward to retire. <laughs> <laughs> I love Cheetos. I like Big Chug. Except human version. You are a big chub. Oh, good God. And, you know, I sometimes just take out on Cheetos and... Oh. Oh. So, apparently, BB, is it? Doesn't want any of this pizza because you're dripping this white shit all over the pizza. She does the same thing to Pete's. Oh, and she's sticking her fingers in and all. It's, what is wrong with you? Please, thank you. We'll just face it. God, that's gross. A lot of stuff that I eat gets trapped in my room, okay? In my Michael, why do you watch this shit if it grosses you out? And it gets found later. Because it's funny as shit. Show. And... Very simple answer. But my bra and my boobs seem to particularly have a taste for Cheetos, just like Big Chub. So... Oh, she really makes my brain hurt. Which is why I watch her. Because... After working for part of the day, oh I really God. need a break. I, was I really need—I need, I need my enough. brain dumbed down to stupid. <laughs> you know, make my boobs look like. And then I can get right back up. To flapjacks or fried eggs. So I like them to wear, wear them about a couple sizes too tight, so it yeah, constricts everything. You know. Why? I can understand if you're getting a better lift. Because it restricts? That doesn't sound very well, comfortable. Oh my god. She's making me sick. Doesn't matter what boyfriend I've had or partner I've had at the time. Whenever it's time to get down. <laughs> and it's time for this to come off, the bra to come off. Because it's so tightly on there, things are so contained under pressure. When the last buckle comes off, it's like a springboard. And <laughs> she knows. Right in the face. <laughs> mm. 
Oh, I, I just, I can't with the, I can't with the dipping. Right in the I really can't. Which, usually embarrassing when it happens at first, but then after a while. No, no Please wipe your face. <laughs> Please wipe right. your face. So that was my first embarrassing situation that I go through in life. And this has happened a few times. So... And I'll give you a hint. You can tell when I'm getting stressed out when my forehead starts to get red and break out and I start to... <laughs> it's a tell. I mean... Oh, God. Mm. Please wipe your face. Wipe your mouth. Please wipe your mouth. I say it's a regular occurrence. <laughs> she even edited it and it's still fucking there. For work. I was asked to go to a conference and like a few hours away in Ontario. Conference. With my boss. <laughs> I'm and, sorry. Uh, I'm pressing X to die like, on that one. Sure. You know, this is a great opportunity, but I don't remember what it was about, but it sounded boring. <laughs> Shouldn't that be, I didn't know what it's a boot. She is Canadian after all, right? So isn't about pronounced a boot in Canada? Just like Putin is pronounced Putin here. And she's not consistent. And she leaves white person. crap all over the pizza. So a bad combination, right? What a nice person. Conference. Apparently BB doesn't, doesn't like pizza. We stayed in a hotel at a conference which was <clears throat> super early in the morning. <clears throat> Excuse me. And um, the good part was that there was like good buffets. There was a lot of good food. Anyway, there was a guest speaker. And we were sitting at the far back. And it was like in a little corner, you know. It was nice and air conditioned on a hot summer day. I was tired. And you know whenever you're like in class and you just like cannot force yourself to stay awake no matter what you do, it's like, and you're like nodding off. <laughs> we used to have a math teacher that used to kick I actually our haven't really felt like that since I was a happened. young man in college. We would be talking about integers and then kick your desk and then keep talking. Anyway, he was nuts. <laughs> I loved him. So anyway. This conference, I end up falling asleep. Nice jump cut. It's Those interesting when she either. decides to edit when she doesn't. It's really interesting. Bite number three, same mouthful. Because the snoring woke me up. Nobody woke me up. They just let me do my thing and, you know, got some very well deserved dirty looks when they did come too, but <laughs> nobody woke me up. I woke myself up. I go, ooh, and started clapping because. But the speaker was over, I guess. I don't know why I started clapping, but. <laughs> Got really quiet. I had to check whether the stream was actually still live. <laughs> I'm like, what? Did she ban my <laughs> channel? Oh, I was mortified. She's like, all right. We fly under the radar. I'd like to think I'm not that boring. I'm going to give people chuckle. Oh, Reminds me of a Stephen Stills right, song that I love to do. The, the Betty Crocker flu. Oh, Jesus Christ. <clears throat> One fine afternoon, I was in the middle of. Well, you know what I mean. I, unless I'm paying attention to the preview, I don't know if the stream's still going or not. <laughs> I see that chat over so here. I'm in the of stuffing those babies in when I get a call from my French lover, okay? And this is a huge piece. Of course she goes for it. Yeah, like baby! Should I eat it? Yeah, sure. Too late. Oh. Anyway. I mean, the pizza actually the pizza <laughs> actually does look good. I love pizza. I, I'm a sucker for pizza. I would never dip it. I, I ever, ever dip it. No, 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 no. I would be super excited to hear from him. Except that I had just eaten large amounts of food, and he has. As you always do. Bathroom. As you always do. I couldn't stand hanging out with him unless I was tipsy or drunk. So I chased those taters with cheap vodka. Oh. 
No, when I say small bathroom, he lived in like a bachelor, crappy bachelor. Oh no, like not crappy, crappy area. No, no, not a bathroom story. Oh, good god. Crappy apartment. So tiny. His bathroom was like tiny. Like the sides of my butt were touching the sink and the tub. That's how small it was. That actually doesn't surprise me. And um, that's a lot of junk in that trunk, baby. The door didn't close all the way. <clears throat> it had like a hook, but like the door stayed open. It had no fan, so you would hear. And it was like the, the bathroom was here. The living room was right there. So I mean, and he didn't have a TV, so there's nothing to muffle the noise of bubble guts, as Trivanda, viewer, one of my foodie beauties, Trivanda likes to say. So, <clears throat> fix me up. <laughs> That's one thing I always hated about going to hang out at like random dude's house when, like in the past. Is that hang on a minute. I'm responding to Coco. Like, what if you have to crap? What if you have to go to the bathroom, you know? I guess this is TMI. <laughs> so for those of you Poor going, girl. Ew. I feel bad for her. You know what I'm like by now? Get over it! <laughs> So I had to go really, really bad. Like, he was like making moves, and I was like, oh my, I, I can't, I'm gonna like. Did you ever go to bed, wake up the next day, and you've got like scars or, or, or you know, like cuts on you on various parts of your body? <laughs> like, part of your body. <clears throat> so I go to the bathroom. I'm like, it's very strange. I mean, like, I wake up and it's like, let it out a little bit at a time, okay. it won't be noisy. It's always noisy. There's one over here. I have no idea what I did. There's, there's one here. And, um, I have no idea where that came from. It was like, what the hell is going on? And the fact that I was embarrassed, like, he was, like, older, much older than me. And he thought that, like, it was immature for me to be embarrassed about it. Because he was like, you fart. So, like, you fart. And he didn't say fart because he was French. I don't know. He's like, you fart. He said fart weird. You fart. So, like, you let it go. You don't talk about it. It's okay. It's body. It's your body. Okay, boomer. <laughs> you want a piece here? And and why, why do her discussions always have to come back to bodily functions and food? I'll throw sex in there, but rarely does she talk about sex. But seriously, just cheese. <clears throat> Sorry, I'm just well, we we stand, Susan, in this channel. You know that. Just try. One piece is good enough for you, eh? Mm -hmm. Well, there's a lot left. For now. <laughs> Alright, last one. See what I mean? Oh, I forgot to show you. Show you some pictures of me as a kid that my mom sent me. So here's... Um, I have a hard time believing he actually ate a piece sister. of pizza. Such a cutie. Oh my god. Then me and my sister. And then me. And I was like 11 or 12. I think I was 12 at this age. Anyway, so... Wait a minute. Does Michael B. Petty have these photographs? The one for now is I remember... I was in my I was in this like phase where I love Rammstein. Okay, I was like obsessed with Rammstein, and I was hanging out at this time with my biggest crush ever, like in school. I think it was like senior year of elementary, and I don't think he liked me that way. But don't ever hang out with a guy that you like and try to be one of the boys just because you want to be around them because they will treat you like one of the boys. And and um, this one time, like this guy would like twist my arm and be rough and I used to like hang around him just like he really he skateboarded he was a skater boy he said see you later boy like a skater boy and I wanted to be so much like a skater chick like a cool skater chick that I pretended I I'm speechless like I was a poser they called them posers I was a poser I didn't want to be a poser but I was and then you know I kept saying oh like I, I like him <clears> until, like, <throat> I can skateboard and all this and that and he kept like, yeah, you don't tell skateboarders that you can skateboard unless you really know how to skateboard. Otherwise, you're going to make yourself so, look like a fool. I was a poser. I wanted to buy a skateboard just to carry it around to like look cool. I bought skater shoes. I had one of those chains. I listened to Weezer. Um, Doesn't make you a skater chick. Those shoes. <laughs> anyway, so. Most of the skater chicks I knew could ride, day, could, could ride that board like it was going out of style. 
One day he was just like, Chantal. Better than a lot of guys. I know you're a poser, it's okay. I know you can't skate. <laughs> Alright, that was so embarrassing. Talk about your double, triple, quadruple Being a poser dipping. Is the worst thing. For fuck's sake. Make it till you make it. Anyway. Jesus. I'm gonna get ready in the morning for school or whatever. Because one day I think I was getting ready for school. It was early morning. I was in my bathroom. In the, my room was in the basement at my mom's. I was getting ready in the mirror, putting my thick black eyeliner on. And I was singing, like I had my earphones on, so I couldn't really hear anything. Blaring Rammstein. Do hush me to come from. Do hush me to come from. You know what song? Do. Do hush. <laughs> she can't stop. She cannot stop. I mean, all you have to do is watch the way she interacts with that food. This is rather scary, to be honest with you. All of a sudden, in the mirror in back of me, I see my friend, the guy, and he's laughing at me. I scream because <laughs> he startled me, and from being mortified, take off the earphones. He's like, what are you doing, dickhead? <laughs> I was pretty embarrassed. I was like, nothing. <laughs> One more piece. See what I mean? One more piece. So embarrassed. And she picked the larger of the two slices. There is a serious disconnect between up here, here, and here with this woman. And if she never gets that figured out, she's never going to stop. She's never, ever, ever going to stop. Oh, God. Oh, please stop. You're making me sick. Oh. My mom, my mom let him in. Don't give him any warning. <laughs> Oh, it's it's scary, Joe. It's more than sad. Holy fuck. Oh. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. I used to be able to eat a large pizza. Used to. Now that was probably 20 years ago. Much younger. 62, you think I could pile down a goddamn large pizza? Are you crazy? No, Jamie, you are you are 100% right. She's never, ever going to change. And I'm serious. I think she's going to end up dying on camera. Or worse, or, or maybe not that bad, she'll choke or she'll, something is going to happen. Something's going to happen, and this poor woman is... is oh. All in the name of YouTube coin. I know. I I, I know. It, 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 it's really hard to watch. I And I agree with you. That's why we're watching old stuff. Because we know where she's at now. It's leading up to that behavior that's just a miraculous journey. And I know that sounds weird. But it's... It's, it's, it's watching her mental state change to the point where you know i'm gonna try mukbang and see how and she just gets consumed i don't no you're not wrong jane you are not wrong x to doubt <laughs> that pizza's gonna be gone before it even hits the fridge that's it for this video I hope you enjoyed me embarrassing myself for 25 minutes straight. Just Not particularly. Just to get your mind off. It's, it's actually alarming behavior. Anyways, guys, you really want to know the I, truth. Um, yeah, I'm so, <laughs> I'm so I think I have one more. I think I have one more. And you don't have to stick around, but I think I do. I think I found another one I wanted to see today. All right. Yes. Sorry, Jamie. Close your ears. It, it, I think you are 100% correct. It is It is sad to watch. Even watching her older tour. No, yeah, it is. 
because she you've seen her go through cycles where she has some serious medical issues she goes to take the care of them and she goes right back to that behavior that caused those issues in the first place <laughs> what are you gonna do hey guys what are you gonna do to cooking with Phoebe. <laughs> today we're gonna be making it's like telling it it's mafia. it's like telling a child not to do something the first thing they're gonna do is do exactly what you told them not to okay. and it is a um, peanut butter stew like i've seen this before it's sauce. actually it's so a decent video this. and there's so many different kinds of recipes oh excellent make Let, please make sure you, you tweet it and it. I'll, I'll be it's happy kind of to watch really simple one. we are going to speed her the hell up because this so many is more vegetables this one is um, actually we are going to add some carrots probably about three carrots chopped up some squash i think there's squash black peppers i don't want to be here that long sure. <laughs> um, some all natural peanut butter you do need the all natural peanut butter and this has um, been reviewed to death i can't tomato paste I prefer the original, but I accidentally picked up Italian herbs. So, some black pepper, two potatoes. Um, I'm probably not going to use all of this onion. I'm probably going to use Don't really need the, potato, the, the onion, tomato paste. And we okay. use three boneless, stainless chicken breasts. Now, most people who make this dish use bone in, but this is just the chicken I have on hand right now. So, and we're going to use two cubes of jumbo, which is just like, it's a type of seasoning, stock cube. You can get these um, in African or Caribbean stores, I think. Um, I, I take it that's like beef African broth African or something like and that. And I'm going to use this to grind the, the cube up. And we're going to use some peanut oil. Not on Twitter. <laughs> peanut oil is what we always use for this type of dish. So. No, I mean, you're right, you're right, you're right. <laughs> Just uh, make sure it gets announced and I'll, I'll, I'll check it out. Thank so you. So these are the ingredients you're going to need for that. So let's Sorry, going. I didn't mean Twitter. <laughs> Phoebe! Okay, okay, so first step we do is we add the chicken breast. This is like cooking ASMR on uh, medium high heat. In the peanut oil, and we're gonna cook it on both sides until it's brown, right, babe? Again, you can tell he does not want to be on stream. He is just not happy here. He's cooking. Yeah. <laughs> so we're just gonna um. You can tell by his body language. And uh, I'll be back when it's chicken brown. Ooh, yum. Look how brown those chicken baby breasts are getting. <laughs> and see the little... I probably would have grilled them. That, or broiled. Doing them in peanut oil? Eh. At the bottom, that's all flavored brown. Man. I know it looks like a lot of oil, but... The juice is from the chicken I'm mixing with that. Oh. <laughs> I wish you could smell this place right now. It smells good, ain't it? It's chicken... <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> I'm, I'm not even going to waste the time. Okay. Mmm, <laughs> yeah. We're almost done. Are we gonna need two cans of tomato paste? Now we're just gonna add the chopped onion. Right into the pan with all that oil. Okay, I have a little bit of a problem with this right off the bat, but you do you, baby. The chicken, we did drain out a little bit of the oil. Um, oh, no, so sweet. There's a um, mixed garlic there on the, in a the jar of bacon. The garlic there. In the jar. Now that he's away from her, absolutely. <laughs> I just wish she would leave him the hell alone. Let him live his life and, and just just leave him alone. Leave him alone. I'm not a great cameraman. <laughs> Add a little bit of minced garlic. To your taste. Everything is to your taste. I mean, you can add as many onions, as much garlic, as much everything you want. For no, you have to add a ton of garlic. Or t sorry, a ton of onion. You have to add a ton, a literal ton of onions. I'm gonna need these ingredients. I'm gonna go chop the potatoes and carrots. Let's go back. Let's go back. I, I just find this cooking style a little strange, hey but guys, okay. Can't really see me very well, but I'm just gonna be chopping the uh, onions and uh, carrots and potatoes to go in a sauce. So. Sauce. In a yeah, in a minute you, the minute you put peanut butter in a sauce, yeah. I know, weird. Right. Did you wash your carrots? Chop, chop, chop. Are you not going to skin your carrots? Have peel you your them? carrots, so to speak. Peel them. Uh, do I need to peel the potato? Yeah. So we're going to chop. The good thing about mate is you can have big chunks of vegetables, like. Usually they put just big chunks of vegetables, you don't have to cut them too small. Because you want them to withstand the cooking, you know? Um, the potatoes. Uh. Oh, right there. So, I'm going to put the lid just let everything cook together for now. And 
So the potatoes, we're just going to cut pieces like that. <laughs> I'm dying over here. I'm dying over here. <laughs> if my mother ever showed me how to make this, I guarantee you it's not going to be like this. Cooperation makes it happen. Cooperation. We're going to get it. Shut up. <laughs> He is just so entertaining, isn't he? I mean, he's talked to the camera like what, three times? Yes, no, hmm. <laughs> okay, so I have that. Getting for stuff. Why did you stick that peanut butter in our face? Be careful with the kitchen knives. Okay, we'll do that, guys, in a few minutes. All right, so we're just gonna add some jumbo seasoning. We're adding it now. Not all of it, just some of it. So just half now. Oh my gosh. That looks so good. Again, this is, there's so many different ways. I mean, his mom and sister, you know, they've been making mache in Senegal for years and years. They're <laughs> just, you know, <laughs> I've, I've never, before I met him, I've never made this, so I can't compare it to their cooking. I've never treated chicken breasts like this before in my lifetime, ever. You know, but we're going to put the lid on for a few minutes, and uh, yeah. Yeah. And this you're going to put those huge chunks of... This is my kitchen! <laughs> Not the cleanest kitchen. Uh, okay. Alright, you know. girl, you do you. <laughs> yes. Oh, and Beauty Jim's Miss Elizabeth. So nice. <laughs> right outside Beep. of the kitchen. How oh, nice. Beep. Hi, Bee. Look at this pretty girl, everybody. Baby Jim's. Baby Jim's. Baby Jim's. And now he's mixing. Is that the whole can? Yeah. Like tomato paste? No, he's no, he's making himself a goddamn Bloody Mary because you won't shut the fuck up. <clears throat> You can add as much tomato paste as you want. We use one can. If you want it to be more tomatoey, maybe add a second can. Uh, no, just use tomato sauce and cook it down. Now, I do use tomato paste. I've used tomato paste in my pizza sauce. I use tomato paste sometimes if I'm making a large bowl of spaghetti sauce. Absolutely. It makes it stretch a lot longer. But this, no, 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 no. no. It's gonna be acidy. Yeah, tomato paste is really acidy. So, but some people really like really tomatoey. Acidic, you dumbass. We don't. And that's not even how you spell it. Acidic. Like the really acidy tomato taste too much stuff. Uh. But cooking it, the way we're gonna cook it here will help reduce some of that acid. So. Oh yeah. And it's gonna mix with all the oils. All the oils. But you only used one oil. Peanut oil. So I'm just going to mix it around, put the lid on, let it cook for a little bit. Looks good, babe. Yeah, I, 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 I get that. I like, I like to use tomato paste. <laughs> My mother taught me to use tomato paste for various recipes, so... When people go off and freak out on, oh my God, you used a can of tomato paste. I'm not freaking out because a lot of it is like, I would do that too. Okay, it's, I do. Adding more water? That's because you used paste and not sauce. If you use sauce and a little bit of paste, you could, you know what? I'm not a chef. I'll shut up now. Are you a big boy or are you a big girl? No one knows. What are you? A big... It's really not hard to figure out whether a cat is a boy or a girl, you ding dong. Boy, big boy. Big boy, big girl. Whoa. This is not hard. Do you want me to show you how to tell? I'll show you. You won't like it, but I'll show you. Hi. <laughs> what are you doing? It's weird being on camera, isn't it? <laughs> I love it. He hates it. He absolutely detests being on camera, especially with you. That body language, if that doesn't tell you anything, oh my god. You know, some people just don't like being on camera, but I'm not one of those. Those fruit flies, see it, guys? Let's name it. <laughs> Babe, we named the bugs in our house. We always name the bugs in our house. Do you like the wreath on my door, guys? I uh, bought it at Pure Wine when it was on sale, and I've had it on my door all season, all year, all seasons. So, <laughs> wonderful. I'm one of those people that don't put things down. So, yeah. <laughs> So it's just cooking away, getting ready to add those veggies. Ooh. I'm not sure that's a laugh, Jamie. So, that's more like a uh, we're cackle. We're putting the veggies in. Bibi is peeling the potatoes because he 
he does not like the peel on potatoes, but I do. I don't mind. In this dish, I would probably peel them as well. Uh, that's just me. Although these potatoes, the, the skin is so thin. But if you're using something like a, a nice russet or something, I would probably peel it. Just saying. <clears throat> but I guess in this dish. But if you're doing a baked potato, leave the skin on. Oh, absolutely. I agree with you there. And even if you're doing mashed potatoes, you can get away with leaving a, a good bit of the skin on. And it's really good for you and very tasty. It's better without the peel. But again, it's pretty much to your preference, so, you know. He's cooking it. Shut up, Chantal. Hi, Shan. Shan, Shan. Oh, hi. But he's swiper right now. Oh, big boy. Hey, little boy. Are you a big boy? Or are you a big girl? Nobody knows, do they? Nobody knows. Sorry, guys, I would get distracted by cats. I'm a crazy cat lady. What can I say? <laughs> so, we've added the veggies. We're going to add more water to cover the veggies. I'm sorry. Those potatoes are too damn large. And so are most of those carrots. You can add as much water as you like. It depends how soupy you like your mate. We like ours more on the thick side. So, and the, um, we poke holes all throughout the chicken breast. The chicken breasts are gonna absorb all that flavor. Mm. It's a very simple dish, but uh, it's very delicious. Well, we put water because, uh, just like the yeah, you have to put, don't you put more water when you put the peanut butter though? Yes. So put enough water at least to cover the veggies and cook them, you know? I don't, I don't disagree that her cats are cute, but her cats do not belong on the counter at all, period. It's your video. It's your channel. You want to show your cats? That's fine. I have no problem with that. I don't, I don't complain, but not on the counter. Please, not on the counter. So now we just let this cook for... People put the cook water food and, cover and, and, and eat let food it, uh, to prepare until food. Until the vegetables are tender, and then you're going to come back and put the peanut butter. Okay, we're getting ready to add the TV, TV and J. No. Just a TV. Oh, look at that. <laughs> That's my new favorite boy. Again, I'm telling you, those vegetables are, I, I don't care. Those are the way too big. Okay. Oh, demonic. Perfect for Halloween. Yeah. Yeah. We're going to add some all natural baby. Oh, and in the meantime, guys, we have our big pot of jasmine rice cooking. That is our favorite rice. It's like a long grain white rice, pretty much. I like jasmine rice. It's good. Yep. I love wild rice though. Oh yeah. man. When I was young, the minute I oh, discovered yeah. wild rice, woo! I was all over that Three stuff. Goodness. Three Everybody teaspoons, okay. Four I had some leftover of that lasagna with some a side salad. Two squares of uh, dark chocolate. Five teaspoons. It. I'm saving my calories for this meal. Six mm. teaspoons. That's a lot of fucking peanut butter, folks. So I think you just put a couple of tablespoons. Um, yeah, six teaspoons is uh, technically two tablespoons. Are you gonna add more water? And add, oh wait a minute, uh, sorry. Three, about two three tablespoons. Three cups, about three cups two of teaspoons water so in far. a table. So he's gonna add probably about another cup. We just eyeball. We really don't measure things. <laughs> and most cooks don't, unless you're baking. Now, if you're baking, you need to be very precise. We all know that baking is more chemistry than anything. So about four cups of water total. And uh, then we're just going to cover the, uh, the stuff up, guys, and uh, let it cook. Uh, um, we're gonna I mean, I would, I would try. Yeah. If, if I learned anything from my parents, I would try it before I made any comments. I would probably not comment. But, you know, they always said, look, just try it. If you don't like it, you don't have to eat it. But you at least have to try it. So I would do that. And, and a reasonable, not just a little... You know, I would try some of the veggies and the meat and all that kind of stuff. For about, I say about what, 20 it's minutes? It's not a huge peanut butter it's fan okay. and sauces. You'll know when it's ready. The um, oil will separate on the top. You'll see what I mean by that. I'll show you when it's ready, guys. Ooh, it's splattered everywhere, but it's good. So we're just going to steam a little bit of the oil off the top. Um, once you stir it in, you know, it makes it... Uh, There's a better way to do that, but, but, but let BB do what BB's going to do. What's up, guys? Of course, goddamn rooster sauce. We are going to eat this delicious mafe. Look at that. That's what I like. And the peppers are just to garnish because they were cooking in the sauce. So, and I have stringy beans, pickles, and curry bush. <laughs> okay, so we're, so, the cats are being bad. So traditionally in Senegal and in other African countries too, you eat off the same big plate. Yeah. Like there's one big plate food made for the whole family and for friends and neighbors to come and eat, right? And they invite everybody to eat. They're so generous. <laughs> and everybody just eats, you know? That cackle's got to go. That cackle is just disgusting. But if I go into your slide, is that rude? Yeah. Okay, can I have the uh, magic or um, 
the bags, Sorry. You're spray, you want some on yours? Spray soy. Now I missed that the first time I saw this video. Spray. This is that. Sriracha. Jesus H Christ! You could you could use a little bit more sriracha. I don't think you have enough. And she doesn't even mix it. No, stop it. Duh! Mm. Mm. I, I'm gonna have to look up this component here. I don't understand what they're fucking spraying on their food. I'm sorry, that just sounds gross. And then we're gonna mix it with pickles. Yeah, if you have any. So, okay, isn't that based on a belief dish? Or is it something Oh, uh, you're killing me! You're killing me! You want something, right? Yeah, but the thing is. Yes, Senegal is West Africa. Dumbass. Senegal has you? Yeah. The country that I have a lot of peanuts is Senegal. Yeah. Hurry up, Chantal. I have to pee. And we have an ALR video to watch here in a minute or two. No, we're not going to snipe it. That's that's rude. Sometimes they have they say they have a real mother. Do you know what they do different than this one? But in Senegal, you very rarely eat your chicken without bones, right? Yeah. Like you would use chicken with the bones. Yeah, because the chicken is cooked there, it's uh, still there. And even if it comes with a... Uh... Better hurry up, Daddy has to go to the bathroom. Still, uh, have the bones. I can't understand a word that comes out of his mouth. And he keeps spraying his crap on his food. Most people have their own chicken. I find that disgusting. Yeah, but not everybody. You have to do it yourself. Oh, okay. Yeah. But she doesn't have her own chickens like her eggs and things? No, not that. I will admit, the pickled and asparagus enough. and stuff, those are always the good. Pretty much every day, right? Oh, you your food. oh, oh. Excuse me. I think I have another one. Yes, I do. Or what? One of the thing is sometimes they have electricity like, stuff, so you gotta have everything stuff. So if you freeze it, Sorry, yeah. Coco. I see. It's okay. Online mm. stuff with men and women is weird, kiddo. Whatever. Because you remember. When's the first time I ate this here? You told me about it. He put a little bird in my ear about mape. It is mape, and I made it. We made it one night, and ever since then, I've been in love with mape. <laughs> like. Yes, but I guarantee you, they don't put rooster sauce on our mape in Senegal. Mm -hmm. Guarantee you that. Apparently it does already or something. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know, it doesn't, it doesn't be like me, but... Well, it's basically peanut I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't get, I, that's weird, Ooh. I just find that really weird. So delicious. That for me is a weird interaction with my food. Yeah. Yeah. Wait, stop! Gumbo? You like gumbo? Gumbo is okra. Okra. Yeah, you can. I think we have some of those in okra. I wish we would have added some. Gumbo is not okra. Oh, I did? Do, do you even know what you're talking okra? about? You can put okra in gumbo. Yeah. Absolutely. It's delicious. Another thing you can do. But gumbo is not okra. I don't know what the hell you're talking about. If you don't like how slimy okra is, you can dry it. They so slice it up, dredge it in flour, salt, and pepper, and then fry it. You don't like it that way? <laughs> I like fried stuff. Of course you do. Actually, how do you think she's gotten to this size? Is that okra? Mm -hmm. And the vegetable. A little bit, eh? Mm -hmm. Sam. Not acne, but. 
Annoying. I'm not sure BB really likes the cats, to be honest with you. And of course, you have to spray this shit on it again. I, I don't get it. I really don't. I need to figure out what the hell that crap is. Thank you. Soy something, soy something. I need a lot. <laughs> Condiment. Last year, in January, will be one year. The liquid. Done, uh, yeah. So I can't quite see that. Why would you spray it on your face? That's um, gross. I'm sorry. January will be one year spray where I actually put this for twice. I need to get rid of it somehow. Where. What have you got left here? Oh, we're almost done. Yeah. 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 It does. It does. One year YouTube anniversary. Whenever I left my job, I was so depressed and unsure about my future. And then just doing YouTube has really kept me. I've just I've met so many people, and it's just really been a new experience for me. It's really I don't know how to explain it. What did you grab? A lemonade. <laughs> right. Hide it behind. Hide it behind the hot sauce. Yeah, I wish you guys could really be here and eat this with us. No, that's okay. Honestly, honestly, I would have prepared that a lot differently, but that's just me. This is very hard. You like it? Yeah. I don't understand the chemistry Ooh. between these two. I really don't. Imagine the amount of sodium he has consumed just in this plate. As we all know, soy is nothing but a sodium bomb. You have Notice she's the only one that needs them. See, I like the way yeah. he, I like the way he adds a little hot sauce. He's got a little pile over there, kind of like when they, when you go to a hibachi place and they have a little uh, uh, ginger and a little wasabi, little dabs of wasabi. Yeah, it's not that, you don't spread it all, it's a little dab. Just a little bit goes a long way. Whew, man, that was really, really good. Oh, that's really good. She reminds me of uh, Amber when it comes to rooster sauce. Damn, get the Take goddamn off. cat off the fucking table! No, I don't think you are. Sammy, the big cat button right there. I do too. I absolutely adore hot sauce. Um, the hotter the better. I've got bottles of rooster and all kinds of stuff. I love all kinds of hot sauce. So but, today, you know, not every dish I make or every dish I eat is spicy. It's not supposed to be. I like my palate likes a little bit of cleansing. You know what I mean? I think ALR and Chantal are a little uh, palate dry, if you know what I'm saying. Baby's playing. What video game are you playing? Okay. 
Battlefield 3? You really know that? I want to play a video game for you guys, but I can't find my glasses. So when I find my glasses, I can't play without my glasses. He's as bad as she is with the ranch. So I probably don't play that. Anyways, guys, I guess we'll go. You know, I'm going to wait for the last brain right league. So uh, thanks for watching Cooking Duties, and wow. see you guys. Thanks for 15K. Wow, and, uh, just wow. I'm going to what you need to do for my one year YouTube anniversary in January. So see you next time. Bye, buddy. All right, folks, I, I thank you for sticking around for the long haul. Um, that was great, Jamie. Thank you very much for all of your friends joining today. I really appreciate it. It was nice and fun. I enjoyed it. Um, tomorrow is the moderator's choice, so it, 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 stop on by tomorrow. Joe's going to drive the bus, and we all know, if you watch chat at all earlier, she can't drive. So we really don't want her driving a bus, but tomorrow's her day. And if any, if last week was as, uh, an indication, I think it's going to be an awesome stream. So stop on by tomorrow. We'll be around three o'clock Eastern time if you if you don't mind. Uh, if you liked the, the stream, give it a thumbs up. If you didn't, give it a thumbs down. That's okay too. Subscribe. Hit that damn notification bell. Or you know what? Probably better shouldn't. So you don't know when we stream. <laughs> also, also. I put a link in the description for all the videos we've watched today. I put a couple teaser links in there. Some other things that, that the moderator and I have put together that thought you guys would enjoy. And if you ever want us to react or commentate or just watch something with y'all, there's a link to a playlist. It's publicly available. Go ahead and, 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 and drop a link in there and we'll take a look at it. All right. Anyway, everybody, thank you very much. I love you all. It's been a great day. I hope you've had a wonderful, fun time. Everybody be good. I love you all. We'll see.